we are hanging out here in California and we are going to come and tour our neighbor's RV. This is Tammy Smith. Hello. And what kind of an RV do you have? So we have a 2001 Terry. It's a 31G. So it's 31 feet long and it's older, but we love it. Awesome. Let's go check it out. Okay. Traveling, exploring, and learning on the road. Fun is family road trip. It's small, but it works for us. It has a 12 foot slide, which is one of the things that makes it really roomy for us. And we tore out the dinette and put in this Ikea furniture. So this has all been remodeled. And it has one of the nice features of these from Ikea is these pull out like this. And then this cushion flips over and it makes a twin bed. So I have one on that side also, and then this folds down into a full size bed. So if I needed to, I can sleep a lot of people in my front room. Currently we have three kids in the front room. So this is a chest freezer. And one of the biggest challenges with having a family on the road is not having a storage, like being able to shop at Costco and that kind of stuff in terms of freezer stuff. So my husband wired a second outlet back here. So when we travel, it has its own inverter that it runs off of. So it keeps it cool when we don't have shore power. One of the things that we put in that's different in our trailer is that this um, bedroom has been completely gutted and redone just to work for our family. So when we started traveling, we had seven kids in here and needed a lot more bedroom space. So we added, you can kind of see the bunk space up there. And now it's storage because we don't need them to sleep up there. <laughs> so we kind of have our room back to ourselves, but of course it's like three feet from everybody else. So, um, but we put a platform in here. And so underneath of here is completely full of storage. And one of the challenges, again, storage is always the big, big question. So this is our storage for our kids' clothes. And then if we were to pull this all the way out, you can see this goes up the middle from there, and I don't know if you can get under there and see, but I have seven totes, three on each side and one in the back. And so that gives us, like, we put stuff in there we don't need very often, um, winter gear, just, you know, there's just stuff you don't get to very often and then we send one of the kids in after it when we need it. So that's where we keep that stuff. Um, in terms of tables, this is a fold up that we added and it comes up and down right here. And so we can use that as extra storage. A couple other things that we did is one was out of a reverse osmosis water system. And this has made a everything wonderful because before we would run into icky water and everybody get dehydrated because we don't want to drink it. Um, so it just is underneath of here. And I don't know if you can see it, but there's a storage system down there, a tank, and then it has other, um, the filters. So we have really, that's one of the things that has been awesome that my husband did. Another option that we did here is um, often the cabinets and things in trailers aren't, they don't use the space really well. And this was one cabinet and we added a shelf because that, um, you know, you can see that now it's used well, but before when it was just one shelf, that was a challenge. We have added a convection microwave. So it was a microwave just before and we added the convection oven because that worked better for us. This is a nifty little thing that we've added in this is a um, roll down screen like you would have for windows. It works really well. We have a small projector that sits over here on the counter and projects onto this when we want to watch a movie. This is a dehumidifier, which is a must if you spend any time in humid climates, especially if you have a lot of people in your RV because you'll start to get condensation on your windows and this will pull that out of the air. And this right here is another fold up table. So you can see it folds up and folds out and we don't use it a lot. We have two bunks back here. 
but Katie hiding down there. <laughs> and another bunk here. So we have five kids with us on this trip. And then the bathroom's just a typical RV bathroom. We haven't done anything special in there. Laundry store. Laundry. <laughs> That's always good. Yep. So we have hanging stuff in here and shoes on these things. These are nice little things. Anytime you can add extra storage because we have them in here for food stuff also. And again, we had to add extra shelves because they never do enough in those things. So it's pretty simple and straightforward, but that's our trailer. Tammy and Todd have been living in their trailer for over four years now. When they started, they had seven of their ten kids with them. Now they're down to only five. For some people, that may still seem like a lot, but for them, they have a lot more space with fewer children. We were thankful for the opportunity to walk around their trailer and check it out. We hope you enjoyed seeing it also. If you'd like to follow the rest of their adventures, you can check out their website, TammyAndTodd.com, where they have podcasts, blogs, and YouTube videos.